All right, so you just got done doing three slides from your pod, and Ms. Axe is going to show you what you should have done. So the first one asks, which of the three words is a contraction? And I tried to trick you on this one because there are three of them that have the potential could be a contraction, but only one is an actual contraction. And the way that you know it's a contraction is it has an apostrophe that you replace that O with an apostrophe. Have not can be turned into an apostrophe and say haven't. Will not can be turned into a contraction and will say won't. But the only one that is a contraction that has that apostrophe is the hasn't. So you should have chose B for that one. Next slide. And the next one um, was just you practicing apostrophes. Um, I had a lot of kiddos that were confused by this one yesterday. So all I wanted you to do was just notice that the words don't and haven't have spaces on them because I wanted you to add apostrophes. Now you didn't have to get too fancy and I had like the exact same color or like all of the red ones had to have red apostrophes. Miss Acton didn't care about all that stuff. But we're just adding apostrophes to all of those. And it says that in the stru instructions too. So a dot and then a tail. A dot and then a tail. And if you're lazy, you can just do a tail. Just a tail. Just a tail. I you to go through and all these haven'ts and don'ts and just practice drawing apostrophes on all of them. So that's what you needed to do on that one. And the next one was a four question quiz. Um, which of the following sentences is correct? So you should have to see which one of these has the word haven't or don't written correctly. So I haven't been able to go to the doctor is what both these sentences say. But as you can see, this one's the only one that has an apostrophe. So that one's the right one. So this one says don't and don't, but this one has don't without an apostrophe. That is not correct. Don't with an apostrophe is written correct. So you should have chose B. I want to go see the movie, but I don't have a ride. It has don't again, don't with an apostrophe, don't without an apostrophe. It has to have an apostrophe for it to be a correct contraction. So A was the answer to that one. And the last one, I haven't told her about the dog poop on the floor. <laughs> the sentence is funny. Um, the haven't has an apostrophe on this one, no apostrophe on this one. So that means B is our answer. So just make sure that you see those apostrophes in those words. Then I'll tell you whether or not the sentence is correct or not. Now, before you go do the last two slides, I think, the last two slides are you actually typing a sentence. I need to show you where that key is. So right now what I want you to do is find your enter button. It's normally on this side of your computer. And it has a little arrow normally underneath of it like Miss Acton's does, but some of the Chromebooks don't. But that enter button, if you go right next door to it, right to the left of it, you'll see your apostrophe button. And the apostrophe is actually the little one down at the bottom. And when you click on it, you don't have to push any other button. You just click on it and apostrophe will show up wherever you're wanting to put it into your word. So find that apostrophe key. Keep it in your brain because you're going to need it on the next two slides where you're typing a sentence and changing the word into an, a, a contraction. All right, so have fun with that. Good luck. I'll see you in just a second.